Mr. Berger, a longtime favorite of many Fayetteville residents, announced earlier this week that it's closing. This will have a heavy impact on several restaurant employees. UATV reporter Mary Kay Carson is live with the story. That's right, and Sawyer, some people are calling this the end of an era. I'm standing outside Mr. Burger right now where you can see the restaurant is packed, and it has been like that ever since residents heard the announcement on Facebook. Now today, as you said, this will bring many changes for the employees that work there, and I was able to talk to one particular employee about what working at Mr. Burger has meant to him. The flour and, flour and water in here, and then make sure all the onions get coated. Elder McVeigh has been making the famous Mr. Burger onion rings for 30 years. He started in high school, and it is a big part of his life. Oh yeah, I like making onion rings and cooking stuff like that for people. After almost 50 years in business, Mr. Burger is closing its doors. Since the announcement, this local joint has been swarmed with customers wanting to get one last burger. One haywire. <laughs> the restaurant opened in the late 1960s and has been a special spot for generations of Razorback fans. I have people come in and say, we went to school here, this is where we dated, and they bring their kids to college. And they say, we just want it to reminisce. For some though, the restaurant is more than just a fond memory. My cook's been here all his life. This is the only job he's ever had. Still kind of bad, but it was worker clothing. Elton says he hopes to have his favorite meal one last time. I miss the burger, a double meat, double cheese burger. I like that a lot. Clark, the general manager, did go on to say that he is one of her valued employees. She said that he's been here for so long that he can now cook, clean, and really do anything around the restaurant. Reporting live and in Fayetteville, I'm Mary Kate Carson for UATV News. Thank you, Mary Kate. The restaurant will close for good this Sunday.